In lesson 2 we saw how we could select the blur part of an image. To start with we selected the outline of this motor car. I'm going to do this very quickly. And then we inverse that selection. We inverse the selection by pressing Ctrl and Shift down and touching I. The selection now is the background and we can now blur that background by going to Filter, Blur, Motion Blur in this case. The direction of the motion blur can be altered by this wheel. The distance of the motion blur can be altered by this slider. And we can go from the quite spectacular and unrecognisable to something a little bit more recognisable. To finish off this image we would make a elliptical marquee 2 selection of the back wheel. Place that over the wheel and filter blur this time radial blur and similarly with the front wheel. Select the wheel, filter and radial blur again. Deselect and there's a car going from 0 to 120 miles an hour in about one and three quarter minutes.